Here's another purchase I made from a few different places. I made um, a QVC order. This is a auto, uh, you know, auto delivery. And then um, I've got some stuff from Walmart. And then I've got my rough greens that I picked up for my dog. Okay, let's go ahead and get into this. This is on auto delivery. And I believe this is my last order for this particular item. It's the purity and the micro delivery by philosophy. And this is just um, face wash and scrub. And I'm gonna go ahead and show Rough Greens. This is a product I pick up for my dog. It's on auto delivery, but I didn't have it come in for a couple of months because I was using a different product. I like to have her on these as well as uh, pumpkin powder. It helps with her digestive system and she's a bulldog so I like to keep this on uh, hand and she seems to really enjoy it so that just came in. It's pretty pricey but I really do feel that as long as you can keep your pets in good shape they don't have to go to the vet as often so that's a plus. The Mentos that I picked up is a pack of six and I normally buy the bags of the gum but this one was $14 and I think 29 cents and this actually ended up being I think a little cheaper than if you bought two or three of the bags so I went ahead and picked this one up and then I picked up this just looked really interesting and decided to go ahead and pick up the 50 piece of tropical gum so that's kind of cool I also picked up some lunch bags and this is a pack of 100 I like to put my fruit in here so it ripens it or if I want to throw something in there like a sandwich doesn't matter um, I want to carry it around in a in a paper bag but I like the bags and I was running out of my other stockpile so I thought I'd pick those up I picked up the traditional great value just regular pasta sauce. These were $1.40. I picked up two of the squash and Vidalia onion by Margaret Holmes. I haven't tried these, but I wanted to get more of a, a different variety of vegetables on the shelf. I picked up the Great Value Peach Tea, and these come in a packet, um, six packets. I like to use these because they're quite easy to mix and even though it doesn't have sugar in it, it actually tastes pretty sweet. I bought the whipping cream and I'm going to put a snippet of the picture of what I did with it and and you'll see I like to, to freeze these. So that's what it looks like there and I just put the date on it and what it was or what it is and that has six blocks of heavy whipping cream and I can take those out as necessary to thaw it and as well as use in baked products or if I need to whip it up for something else. I also picked up the unsalted and salted butter. These have become increasingly expensive. They're now $3.58 for four sticks of butter each. I, I find that quite high so yeah there you go. These are the Cosmic Crisp Apples. I bought another bag of these. I really like these apples and I like to dehydrate them. I also picked up Navel Oranges and this is a four pound bag. It ended up costing $5.30 and I found that that was cheaper than buying in them individually at 86 cents per orange. I thought I would throw these in. A friend of mine gave me 12 eggs and what I'm going to do with these is I have pickling lime coming and I'm going to and I'm going to take this and put it in the jar that I picked up from Walmart, which is the gallon anchor hawking glass jar. And I'm going to do the solution to put it into this. I got the idea from Appalachian Homestead, Patera, her video, or she stuck up a, 
a picture of it on YouTube anyways I thought it was really good to put it in glass instead of in a big five gallon bucket it's just easier for me because I don't have chickens but my friend gave me these because I'm going to barter with her with some pickling lime when it comes in so that's what I'm going to do so that's the haul guys it's just a few items that I picked up over the last couple of days if you guys have any questions or anything that you'd like to see please share it with me in the comments and I will be sure and respond thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video